Here are eight vocabulary words that go along with lesson 17. You will see these vocabulary words in Luke Goes to Bat. Word one, practice. If you practice hitting the baseball every day, your hitting will get better. Practice. Read it with me. Practice. What does it mean? If you practice an activity, you do it many times so you get better at it. Practice. Our second vocabulary word, hurried. The soccer player hurried to stop the ball. He moved fast. Hurried. Read it with me. Hurried. What does it mean? If you hurried to do something or go somewhere, you tried to finish it or get there quickly. Hurried. Our third vocabulary word, position. The batter is in position to hit the baseball. Position. Read it with me. Position. What does it mean? When someone or something is in a certain position, they are sitting, lying, or arranged in that way. Position. Our fourth vocabulary word, roared. The crowd roared loudly as the player caught the ball. Roared. Read it with me. Roared. What does it mean? If an animal or person roared, they made a loud, deep noise. Roared. Our fifth vocabulary word, extra. The extra players for the football team sat on the bench. Extra. Read the word with me. Extra. What does it mean? Something that is extra is more than what is usual or needed. Extra. Our sixth vocabulary word, curb. After skating, the girl rested on the curb outside her house. Curb. Read it with me. Curb. What does it mean? The curb is where the sidewalk meets the edge of the road. Curb. Our seventh vocabulary word, cheered. The audience clapped and cheered as the player scored a goal. Cheered. Read it with me. Cheered. What does it mean? When people cheered, they shouted in happiness and excitement cheered. The eighth vocabulary word, final. When the game ended, the final score was four to two. Final. Read the word with me. Final. What does it mean? If something is last or at the end, it is final. Final. These are the eight vocabulary words that go along with lesson 17.